On this final part of our tour, we're going to put together a little bit of everything to give you more of a feeling of how powerful Touch and Pro can be. First, I'm going to log into my connection and use file system navigation to find my Apache configuration file. And now that I've found it here, I'm going to tap the copy button to copy the full path to the clipboard and then switch back to my home directory. And back in my home directory, I'm going to use the clipboard here to paste in that file name and copy the file back to my home directory. And now that I'm here, I'm going to use the Emacs command that we created in the last video to launch Emacs and bring up some custom keypads. I'm going to use this custom keypad here to find my configuration file, but instead of typing the full thing, I'm going to use the autocompletion interface to um, find the httpd.com file and then hit return to load it. And now that it's loaded, I'm going to page down using my custom keypad here. And I want to work with a server root command, uh, server root parameter. So I'm going to move down and I'm going to use the copy and paste interface here to bring up the selection markers and then highlight this line. And I just want to copy it, so tap in the upper left to copy. And then I'm going to paste it back in. And go back here. And then use this kill command here that I have set up and start type filling in the new server root parameter. And again, I'm going to use the autocompletion interface here to make it easier to type in this parameter. And we'll put it in user share and then htdocs. Close the quote, hit return, and also I'm going to go back up in here and add the comment character to comment out the old line. And so those are the changes I wanted to make. I'm going to hit the save button here to save the configuration file. And then I'm going to hit quit, which is going to issue the control X, control C, and also actually going to send a yes to confirm that I want to quit. And then hide the custom keypad and switch back to the original profile. So this concludes our Touchstone Pro video tours. We hope you've enjoyed seeing some of the features that Touchstone Pro has to offer. Please visit our extensive online support site for more detailed information about how you can fully take advantage of the powerful features of Touchstone Pro. Thanks for listening.